Hello, my lovely Pisces. How are you doing this morning? Hello, hello, hello to you. I love you. I love you to pieces. Pisces, let's say thank you, Jesus, for waking us up this morning. And today is the best day of your life. You hear me? Of your life. Now, shout out to Familiar, which is telling sister, I love me some you. And Nicole, I mean, come on now, you know, I'm promoting these cars. If you don't know, pick one of these cars every day, and it'll tell you a lot about what's going on in your life. And that's everybody. You want to learn tarot, you want to know where you are at, get a tarot card. Get one that's updated, like something that you can relate to, like you can see pictures on it, right? And these are very easy to read. So get a tarot deck that you can easily read, right? And then... Pull one car out a day, excuse me, and that car will tell you what is going on in your life because it's good for you to do that. Not only do you, um, does it help you, but you learn and you know you could be reading tarot. You know, you got a gift, honey, you already know that. And I'm just eating ice and drinking water, honey. I was outside and Doing readers this morning, and boy, oh boy, oh boy. Whew, Jesus, I wish I could tell y'all everything I'm doing. Mm -mm -mm. Anyway, so let me uh, start off doing this reading here, right? So I got Sweet Legal Justice, familiar with his title, baby. It's called Sweet Legal Justice, and they, they are by Nicole. So if y'all interested in getting them, you know, you can get in touch with me, and I will get in touch with her. With Nicole and um, you can get them right. And thank you, familiar with yourself, for promoting Nicole's cars. All right. So I'm gonna do this reading. And as y'all all know, I already send everybody's orders out. Your orders out. I just gotta put your tracking number. But your orders went out. And if anybody need the sweet justice, um, you know, spell break a candle. There it is, right. Abundant Prosperity Candle, the Love Yourself Candle, and everybody knows I breaks it up when it comes to the justice. Okay, this is Palo Santo and Sage. This is the um, walnut bath that you need to work with your dark side. These are my um, bracelets that I wear on my neck, on my ankles. Uh, my crystals, okay. My detox salt, spiritual salt bath, which is not... Um, essence salts, it's cave salt, and I also got herbs in the bath. And you know how I get down with this right here. This right here is the brick dust, the uh, red brick dust, right? Say hi to Jay Short because he love walking around here naked, honey. My grandson is a Libra, and he love, love walking around here showing his little big old butt. He got a butt bigger than a girl, honey. That don't make no damn sense like his father and his grandfather. Jesus, you can sit a damn table, a plate on his behind. All right, now, he said some girl used to smack his butt That's in school. He told me some girl used to smack his butt in school. I said, what is wrong with the girl? He said, I ain't never tell this to nobody, Nani. But um, this girl used to smack me in my butt. I said, okay. All right, you got police and call the lawyer. Oh, my God. What is up with that police and call the lawyer? Help me. The police and call the lawyer? Help me. Y'all better be careful with these crazy people out here. The police and call the lawyer. So y'all be careful out here with people, okay? Be careful. Okay? Listen to this. File a, 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 it says, wait a minute. The police and call the lawyer. Help me. Did somebody get it locked up and, and now they need a lawyer? And it says, file a report. All right, what happened here? What is going on? What's going on? What is going on, honey? It says, offer coming in, money, job, quit and buy. Somebody quit their job? 
is somebody having trouble with baby daddy and I don't know, harassment, is somebody feeling like they need to file a report, is somebody feel like they need to make more money and quit their job to get a better job, what's going on, what's up Pisces, mm -mm -mm. stop playing, stop playing, I don't know why today feel like Saturday to me. I know a lot of people, a lot of Pisces are traveling and moving and, you know, got a whole bunch of stuff going on. But please, honey, be careful. Just be careful. Don't get into no arguments. And if you got a problem with your daddy, baby, father, or your kids or somebody locked up and they, you got, just be careful, all right? Remember one thing. The more problems you got, guess who's getting paid? The lawyers. The problems you have, the lawyers, the ones getting paid. Okay? The charity. Pursuing willpower. Persevere in willpower. Somebody is making a decision and leaving some behind. And when I tell you they leaving something behind, they leaving something behind. And they leaving something behind like money, a home, a person that was taking care of, a nice job, or a relationship where it was good. They leaving it all. They saying, ain't even worth it. I'm out of here. Look at that. All up in the clouds. Look at this. Leaving it. Like you got two rows. And I say, you said, whoop, I'm out of here. All right. So are you dealing with a cancer? And I'm telling you, you like the night, you like moving out, you like leaving shit behind. Is somebody traveling somewhere? Is things moving fast for you? Did you just go through a lawsuit, a divorce, a separation, moving out of a home, a new job? Did you win a case? I don't know, Pisces. You look like you're moving fast. The King of Wands. Goal oriented. Somebody here is moving fast. And I'm telling you, the King of Wands is somebody that's organized. Somebody is about, they, they, they work. Somebody's a builder. Somebody is into structure. Somebody is into balance. They want to, they see the good in everybody. You know, um, they like that, um, have fun. They, they, um, they, it's like Superman. Like, you ready to, to fly high? I want to fly like an eagle. You hear me? Somebody here, and it's two things. See, you got, the charity moving fast. Superman here, honey. Saving the day, honey. What? Like, things are going to be moving for you very, very quickly. Okay? Like, somebody is sitting on top of the world, honey. Making moves. Making moves. Building structure. Opening something, being creative, being organized. They like to do things in a certain way, all right? The five of coins, somebody feel like they are missing out. Things that will be moving on for you and, you know, and building and new things moving along. Uh, job offers, moving to a home, relationship. I mean, moving on. Uh, money coming your way. Quitting a job for something better. But somebody feel like um, they missing out on you, honey. They feel like you leaving them out in the cold. It's like Pisces is moving on and Pisces say, I don't give a damn. I'd rather not have shit if I got to deal with you. I'd rather not have anything if, you got, if I got to be under you like a damn puppy. Pisces, you're moving on very quickly. Things are going to be moving on for you. But somebody feel like they like you left them out. Like they're not a part of you or what you're doing. 
Like you're making somebody feel like they're not worthy of you. Damn, did I say that? Worthy of you. Oh, my God. You got somebody over here thinking. Somebody here thought that they was going to, um, you know, like play you out. But they got played because they the ones with the um, trust nice Got a briefcase, but look how they living fucked up. They got they look nice, got a briefcase, but they missing out. Look at that. Look at that shit. They missing out. They living look at that plants growing in the house. Yeah, they they you know, like they jobless, like they homeless, uh but you know, they not looking good, you know, while you moving on. Like, you know, that's what happens when people try to feel like since they got money, they can sue you or take you to court, they don't want you to have nothing, they just want you to sign you off like you don't even exist, but at the end, they the one that's paying the price, they pay the price for a lawyer, now they're paying the price because they ain't got shit, mm -hmm. like I mean, somebody thought they could leave and be Superman, but wind up being left out. See, when people think that they can do that to you, I don't never say send it back to the sender because I know God has eyes all over the place. All right? He's the creator. Coming more. The strength. Pisces. You might, um, have a child. Care for a mother and your child. Some of y'all care for your mother and a child. Or, um, but it took everything out of you to stand up and make a move. It took everything out of you to leave everything behind and say, I got to move on. And you said, damn it, why am I going to worry about having everything when I didn't have nothing anyway? Because I'm walking away from everything that one time meant something to me. I had to move on because it's not working for me no more. But I also got to stand up to it. So you're doing good. And I don't know if you took somebody to court or whatever it is, but you, you're looking good. No love lost. This is my car for no love lost, the queen of sorts, no love loss. I'm not mad at you. I'm just telling you straight to your face. I don't love you anymore. Okay? Like the respect I had for you one time, I no longer have it. All right? Because of the way you did me. You foul. You foul on me. You act like, you, you know, let me foul this on you or let me do this. It's like you kept threatening me. Threaten me, trying to rush me, right? Thinking that you want to move on, move on, baby, move on, baby. But everything you ever wanted, Pisces, coming to you, right to you, because ain't no love lost. Like, really? Like, you really think that I'm really stressing over you? I don't think so. No, I'm being straightforward. I've been through enough with you. It's like you've been through so much with somebody. You've been through hell and back with somebody. You have to tolerate people, a situation, right? You have to put up with a lot of shit, a lot of shit. And sometimes people think that they can just do whatever they want to you, but it don't go that way, right? And sometimes, Pisces, you don't even see how strong you are until they show you how strong you are. It's not that you, you don't see it. It's that they show you how strong you are. You know why? Because they finally feel like, oh my God, I don't believe that she's doing this. Or she's talking to me like this. Or she's treating me like this. Like, you don't even know what you're doing, but they notice. Tell me more about this five of pentacles. Tell me more about this five of pentacles. All right. This is crazy. Again, these cards keep coming out the Five of Swords. 
Why should I argue with you? You can have what you want. Is it worth it? I mean, sometimes people think that winning is everything when it's not. They really think that if I got one over you, I'm winning. Right? But winning isn't everything. It's not. Because at the end, neither one of us, neither one of us win. Right? You pay, I get, but then I had to pay too. Right? So it works out even. I mean, shit. Somebody here has got to learn to maintain and have um, the power to say, you know what, I had enough of you. You win. Go ahead, baby. You got that. No love loss. Because when that happens and somebody think they want something over you, you will always, always replace them with your material world. They might can take anything from you. But your abundance come right behind them. All right? Your abundance come behind. It's like they want to make you feel like you left out. You don't have shit. I'm not giving you shit. But in reality, you gaining everything. When I mean everything, everything. The material world, your peace of mind. You gain it all. And they think that they doing something wrong to you. By treating you like shit. And I, and I always tell a Pisces, they treat you like royalty shit. Like royalty shit, okay? That's the way they treat you, like royalty shit. That's the crazy part. And I throw the royalty in there, okay? But yeah, that's how they treat you. Like royalty. Trash. All right? Now, let's let's move on. Pisces, it's all good, Pisces. Trust me. Everything is going to be okay. Things are going to be moving fast. They might think they got something over you, but they don't. Let them think what they want to think. As long as you don't fall into that bullshit, that state of mind that they had you in one time, you're going to be all right. Tell me about the strength of Leo. Are you dating a Cancer, a Leo? Are you dating a Cancer or a Leo? All right, what else do I got here? You got a lot of um coins, coins, swords. Somebody's all up in their head about their money, making a decision which way I should go. Okay, but everything is going to work out, baby. I mean, what? Once you hit rock bottom, you got to come back up, Pisces, right? All right, make a decision, make them. Make them and move forward because if you don't make them, if you don't make a decision, then you can't move forward. You got to make a decision to move forward. Sometimes Pisces stay in, in, rest, in, um, in uh, relationships and in jobs until you get fired or they leave you. Then once they leave you, you go through that. The strength of getting back on your feet and getting what you want. But it's only when you get fired when they leave you. Because Pisces, we don't leave people like that. Right, and we don't leave our jobs like that. We we tolerate shit. So with the strength card and this cancer that you dated might be dating whatever, the six of cup is someone you know and that's wanting to come back. All right. And it's somebody on the side of the house watching. So are you seeing somebody? Pisces, I ain't gotta tell the business like that, but damn Pisces. All right, Pisces. The Queen of Swords. With the two of wands, there's somebody looking over there or whatever it is that you're waiting on. Information, like you're getting it. And it's coming to you right to your hand. Somebody may be traveling. Somebody may be moving on. Um, but it, it's like you may feel like it's something far from you, but it ain't far at all. It's very close to you. You, you may think that you can't reach a person, but it's like so close to you that you can touch it. And it's coming your way. You just, you just sitting there like, okay, I'm waiting on it. Just like the Queen of Swords, like she's sitting there waiting on it. And it's coming right to your hands. Believe me, it's coming. All the information, everything you want is coming right there. And it's when you least expect it, Pisces. Tell me about this uh, um, 
Ace of Pentacles. So what is going on with this Ace of Pentacles? Tell me what's going on with this Ace of Pentacles. Tell me what's going on with this Ace of Pentacles. Tell me what's going on with this Ace of Pentacles. Oh, God. So you got the Ace of Pentacles. You got the, um, the sun. You might have that wall up, but that baby is happy as hell. And it got that red flag. That's right. I'm going to parade with the little the little flock, the little feather on their head. Like, yeah, and I'm, right, I'm riding that white horse. What's up? And shit, y'all might not have to see me because I don't have clothes on, but shit. The sun is telling me the sunflowers are shining with all oh, like it's a wall of sunflower as far as the eyes can see. Let me tell you something. If I ever get married, if I ever get married, I don't want roses. I want sunflowers. That's all I want. I want a bouquet of sunflowers. I want the whole room to be full of sunflowers. If I don't have nobody coming to my wedding, I will have sunflowers representing people. Oh, yes! Oh, Jesus. Yes, Lord. And it's all good prices because you got the ace. Like I said, don't even argue with nobody. Don't even listen to me. Whatever they want to do, they can do. All right? It's all good however they feel about your prices. You don't have to argue with nobody because God is giving you that ace of pentacles. And he's giving you the sun. And he's giving you the ten of cups. Everything you want. And he's giving you the ace of wands. So you got the ace of pentacles and the ace of wands. Created money. Everything. Love. <laughs> what else can you ask for? You get abundance. You get love. Prosperity. You get it all in a package. You can't ask the universe for anything more. The ace is, is what the universe is giving you. You got the ace of pentacles and the ace of one and the ten of cups. Are you kidding me? Amen to Friday, damn it. Pisces, if you need a reading, get it for me or someone else. Because you know I don't hate on no damn body. It's enough out here for everybody. I don't hate on nobody's parade, baby. Not me. Oh, hell to the no, to the no, to the no. All right? Pisces, the world belongs to you. And whatever you want to fit in that world is yours. And don't you ever be afraid to close and leave it, walking. Because when you walk away from it and you leave it, or they walk away from you and they'll leave you, or you quit a job or whatever it is, then you get the strength to get your ass up and do something better for your damn self. How you going to wake up and go somewhere where you don't even want to be? How you going to wake up to a person you don't even want to see? When you let go of all that shit that you don't want in your life, God will open up so many doors for you that it's unbelievable. You got to clear the mind and make a way. All right, Pisces, I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. One love, damn it. Bye.